He may play in Las Vegas, the city that never sleeps. But after a solid eight hours last night, you can bet big on Josh Jacobs this week. Woo! There we go, Julio Jones. What a start. Are you kidding me? His special teams already returned the kickoff? What the f***? Uh, why did I start Dak instead of Kirk Cousins? Yep, yep, yep. That's why I started Dak instead of Kirk Cousins. Seriously, Adrian Peterson stuffed at the one yard line three times? He should be benched for the rest of the season. Uh, Zach Gertz is on a bye this week, idiot. Enjoy that goose egg. Well, I'm screwed. No one coming back from this. Career high in receiving yards. Woo! That's how it's done, son. Are you kidding me, Aaron Jones? Two points? Are you serious? And it's good. Yes. Just hold him there, and it is in the bag. No, he can't. He won't. He won't. He don't. He won't. He did. He did. He did. Ah, Nick. I see here that you've been feeling a little under the weather lately. Uh, Intense bouts of diarrhea in a rainbow of colors, is that correct? Yes? Now, let me see. Um, let me check something. Yes, your belly button is still an innie. That's excellent. Well, they say laughter is the best medicine, which is fortunate for you, Nick, uh, because your team is a joke. My prescription is 10 deep belly laughs daily until you begin to cry. I've got Jess here with me, and we're gonna run through these questions. You wanna say anything before we start? I'm so nervous right now. <laughs> <laughs> she has not seen these questions. I don't know what they are. So, we're just gonna fire away here. All right, on a scale of one to 10, how much would you say that I care about fantasy football and why? 14. <laughs> because it's like, it's the trifecta. It's the guys, it's the sport, and it's like something that you can access. Like, there's something you watch the game on your on the TV, and then you also check it on your phone. You can also have something on your iPad. So it's like 100%. Yeah. What is my most annoying oh, habit? Leaving crumbs on the counter. <laughs> I don't even have to think. <laughs> what do you think I enjoy most about fantasy football? That's true. What is my favorite way to spend an evening? During football season? Any evening. Sports, watching sports. It's a bonus if I'm on the couch with you, watching sports, but watching sports. How much do I talk about fantasy football? God, all the time. All the time. Who's my favorite actor or actress? Is it Adam Sandler? I think when I was 20. <laughs> I don't know, who is it now? Now that you're mature and graying. I don't know, I'm just gonna say Chris Hemsworth because I have a man crush on him. I think it's the accent. You think it's the accent? I think it's the accent. Okay. I think it's his biceps. Personally. Wow. <laughs> Who's one guy you think I enjoy beating the most in fantasy football and why? Your brother. 100% Steven true. Russell. Yeah. He stole a champ championship for me. I hate you for that. We have never... Every year, every year, we, we hear that. this whole story all over again. Um, and I think you just heard why. What could I talk about for hours? I feel like this is a trick question because we've already said fantasy football, but fantasy football, or like sports stats. When have I been the happiest or angriest about fantasy football? When you lose to Steven, <laughs> when you're losing to Steven, when you feel like you should have won against Steven. The second part of that question. Happiest. When you beat Steven. Oh, okay. <laughs>
All right, how do you think I would do in a zombie apocalypse scenario? I mean, for my own self-preservation, I hope that you would be like the gritty warrior, but I worry that you would be like a little too nice and like let somebody in the door who like wasn't supposed to be there. Like if they didn't really look like a zombie. Right. I'm, so, so what you're saying is I'm compassionate. Yeah, but like too so. Like you gotta chisel that off. Okay. In apocalypse time. All right, I'll work on that. Okay. What's the strangest thing you? heard happen at one of the fantasy football drafts. Oh, Jesus. I think it was a leg waxing incident. Yes. Like, I won't wax my own legs. Oof. I think it's the leg waxing incident. <laughs> I think that was Daryl. I think it was Daryl. He also had the habanero bet. And you know, now that I think about it, he's actually probably had the worst end of most bets. That's what makes this so fun. Any parting words? Good luck, y'all. <laughs> to me. Yeah.